Hey everyone, we're here at the WWE Performance Center that just opened up in Orlando. This is the place where all of the up and coming wrestlers come to train and hopefully make it to the big time in wrestling entertainment. We're getting a behind the scenes tour today, so come along with me, let's see what's going on. could say that they are undefeated in the history of WrestleMania matches and the WWE Universe shows their appreciation for the dead man. A, a basis of what is exactly the purpose of this performance center? Uh, this is where dreams come true. This is where uh, uh, your dream of being a, a WWE superstar come true. It's something that the WWE backs totally. Triple H had, uh, Hunter had a great uh, vision of putting this together. It's done, it has everything that you could want, every coach you could have, every head coach you could have, all the facilities to have the opportunity to be a star. It's great, it's just, it's like, uh, I wouldn't even say, I'd say it's bigger than minor league baseball. Where do you get your next players? Where do you get your superstars from? When do you get your, your next reporters from? Well, right here we build them all. Now why Orlando? Orlando is a, is a place to where it's so growing in our relationship and uh, with Full Sail is such a, a needed part of our WWE uh, vision. And Full Sail is here, of course, and uh, our NXT tapings on Thursday are here. But it's, it's the, I think to me, it's the cross section of how many people around the world come here. So they bring their kids and they come here to uh, Universal and to Disney and the atmosphere is like just, man, like I used to say, funky like a monkey, man. I mean, let's get pepped. If you can't get excited about this, so it's exciting times and there's so many people here and there's so much to do here. Central Florida is such an amazing place to live, to work, to play. And we had this amazing global asset in Full Sail University and the opportunity to match our global sports entertainment brand with a university that does such an amazing job in teaching everything that our workforce at WWE delivers. So we started taping uh, our NXT program, which is internationally distributed in nearly a hundred countries. We started doing that every three weeks alongside the students at Full Sail and the leadership team. And soon it became apparent that Central Florida had some amazing resources that it could bring to bear. So as we were thinking as WWE about our future talent development strategies, it just made very good sense in the uh, adage of success breeds success to think about Orlando, Central Florida as a global destination. And talking about those performances at Full Sail, University. Is that something that people are able to attend, watch? We do. We tape on average of, of every three weeks at Full Sail Live, which is their live event uh, venue uh, at Full Sail. Tickets are available to the public. And what makes it so unique beyond the fact that Full Sail students are working alongside our professional production staff is that Central Floridians, those visiting Central Florida, can go over and see a world-class let me underscore world-class production happening right here in Central Florida every three weeks. Our main roster superstars coming to support 
the next generation of superstars. So go on WWE.com, figure out when we're going to be here next, buy tickets, and come get a piece of the universe that is WWE. Can you describe to us a little bit about your training that you went through? This is something that takes place years. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's definitely a craft because everything is, you know, improvisation on the fly, feeding off the crowd and doing things like that. It's I equivalent it to Shakespeare's theater in the round, you know what I mean? We're not just playing to one camera right here. We've got people over here, there, somewhere over there. So there's things all around. So the training is very intense. As you see, you know, we've got our weight room in there. We've got the athletic trainers in case someone gets injured. We've got the stuff here in the ring. We've got stuff in the back to work on interview skills, uh, communication skills, things like that. So it's a very arduous task. So if you're not fully into it or putting everything you have into it, it's not something that's going to work out. So that's the tip. You got to want it. Bad. Well, I think you're doing pretty well for yourself. From what Thank I understand, you. Triple H handpicked you to kind of represent yeah. the company at the new awesome. opening. Yeah. What do you expect to happen next? I don't know. I mean, it's like he told me the world is your oyster, you know. So when you hear stuff like that, it's, it's really good. But getting the chance to do that, it kind of showed me, you know, they put their trust in me that they, you know, allow me to do something like that. And to have that opportunity is, is amazing. It's so good. So it's like a dream come true. WWE is the... I believe the top entertainment company in the world, so um, I'm just happy to still be doing it. Well, there you have it. Your behind-the-scenes tour of the new WWE Performance Center. Any of these guys and girls could be the next big thing in wrestling entertainment. Now, keep in mind that since they work here, they also live here. So when you're walking around Orlando, keep your eyes open. You never know who you might see.